Oh, it's not people. I, don't, I, I never understand the giving the finger, especially when they're the ones, the vehicle that cuts me off. And I honk the horn and they brake check and then they give me the finger. And then all I want to do is motion them to just, you know, let's pull over to the next exit to have a chat. And they keep giving me the finger and all that stuff. I would love to have them pull over with me and let's chat it out. Because I want to understand how you can cut somebody off on the freeway, brake check them when they honk at you, and then you give them the finger. What kind of a fucked up life must you have to do that shit? I mean, I don't even, like, I don't get it. I, I, I want somebody to explain it. Like, it mesmerizes me. I'm on the fucking hook with these things. This is like the biggest fucking lure ever. These kind of cocksucking fucking cowards. Honestly, I mean, I, I can't think of anything more cowardly than that. Than that type of behavior. You're cutting somebody off, and then you have the audacity to think that, what, you're in the right about it? And, uh, and then I'm like, yeah, come on, let's, let's go over the next exit. And of course they're zipping off along the way. It's interesting how bold people get in this fucking vehicle, the anonymity behind it. Just, they get real fucking bold. And, um, I don't know how to put these people like, like that in check. I don't know. How does that work? How do, how do, like what? What do I do? Just do, do I have to get the dash cam going and come up with something? I don't know. Selfish asshole driver of the freaking week in whatever city. Oh man, that got me going. Some days are better than others, but that one got me going. Cause you know, he's a coward. There's no way he's not, but he thinks he's not. But he is.